Campylognathoides, as the name was thus preoccupied, he renamed the Pterosaur Campylognathoides in 1928. During the 20th century, new finds have brought the number of known specimens to about a dozen. Three species of Campylognathoides have been named. Campylognathoides zitali is the type species. The larger Halsmidin Campylognathoides, C. zitali, had a six foot wingspan. Campylognathoides liasicus. Liasicus had a three foot wingspan, making it smaller than its Halsmidin contemporary, C. zitali. Reflecting the more shallow snout, the teeth of Campylognathoides are also short and not at all laniaries or fang-like as in the markedly heterodont Dorignathus. After a period in which very little work was done on pterosaur systematics, in 1967 Oscar Kuhn placed Campylognathoides in its own subfamily within the Ramphrinchidae, the Campylognathoidina. Campylognathoides is the basalmist member of the Noveloida, which is defined as a node-based taxon consisting of the last common ancestor of Campylognathoides, Quetzalcoatlus and all its descendants. Pterosaurologist Kevin Padian has suggested that, in view of the stout short teeth ideal for delivering a piercing bite, the form might have been a predator of small terrestrial animals instead. Conversely, Mark Witten suggests the construction of Campylognathoides' extremely robust forelimbs, with proportionally long wing fingers, could be a specialization for a fast aerial lifestyle comparable to those of falcons and mastiff bats. 5. Dindicfortius aventine, 